A local grandfather has spent more than 10 years of his retirement caring for babies in need of extra love and attention, and now he needs support as he fights his own battle. David Deutschman is better known as the NICU grandpa. He volunteers at Children's Healthcare of Atlanta and spends his time comforting babies that were born prematurely. David is there to hold them when their parents cannot be there. Some of my guy friends asked me what I do here, and I told them, well, I hold babies. Sometimes I get puked on, I get peed on. It's great. And they said, well, why would you do that? And, you know, they just don't get it, what, the kind of reward you can get from holding a baby like this. Recently, David was diagnosed with stage four pancreatic cancer. And to show their love and support, employees at Children's held a drive-by parade outside of his home, complete with the hospital's NICU transport truck and a helicopter. And Cheryl, this is a man who has put out so much love into the world. And we wanted to share some of the comments from people who have heard this story and just want to send their love and support tonight. Sandra said, my youngest had to stay in the NICU for three weeks. It was a difficult time for his dad and I. I am sure that Mr. David gave so much comfort to the parents and the infants with his gift prayers for David and his family. And Crystal said, I had a preemie 28 years ago and lived over two hours away from the hospital mm -hmm. with an 18 month old at home. I know what a blessing yeah. this gentleman must have been to the families he has touched. I pray God touch and heal his body. And this has been such a remarkable story from when we first were introduced to yeah. Nikki grandpa to now knowing that he needs our community support. And it just says so much to live your life in a way that people care so much mm -hmm. about you when these sorts of tragedies happen. Even strangers from all over the place knowing Nikki grandpa and sending their prayers and love tonight. Yeah, Cheryl. He's receiving some of the love that he gave not ex expecting anything in return. My fourth child was a, was a NICU baby. It just means so much. And Aisha, we heard that in that drive-by in some of those cars were those little babies grown up that wanted to wave and thank him in person uh, for that gesture that they don't remember, but their parents would never forget.